doing a lot of damage, but hardly any form of breakthrough anyway. There's a LST. What's going on here? Total missile unit. Yikes. How many units do I have that are possibly available? Not a whole lot. Come on, is it possible to take the capital? Just focus on... Oops. Where the hell is this guy going? Jeez. Get down there. All these units need to get down to the military facility of Seoul. I know. Ah, oh, God. Focus on Seoul, try to take it out. Argentina again. That unit at capital is not gonna fall anytime soon. We're losing more and more air power. Alright, come on. Is it possible? Is it possible? Come on. Yeah, we're taking a lot of losses. Okay. Sheesh. Let's take a look and see from up here. Usually, there's usually a delay anyway. At what? Base destroy. Oh god. <laughs> Looks like we have to rebuild it. But there we go. South Korea is long gone. The old Korean Peninsula is now under our control. And all the units that are here. Holy crap. We have a bigger military down here, but... Like I said in previous videos, the AI is not that smart. And as a result, they couldn't do anything, so... Okay, that's good. Now I've got to go to... Elevate... Yeah, I'll go with guard. Go to low... And have everybody head home. And for the South Koreans to be under the new regime of... The Greater Korean Republic. If you don't know what I... If you don't know what I meant by that greater part... I got it from another game that... Uh, for, uh, well, I'm sure I'm sure he may, some of you may know as the t of the title, of course, but I might as well say it anyway. It's from Homefront. Okay, as for Europe, Russia is attacking several neighbors, such as Estonia, Latvia, Poland, Belarus, no, Ukraine, the Georgia Republic, Finland. And, yeah, Serbia is in the middle of a multi-front war. Or who else? No, no, no. Not really much going on with the rest of Western Europe, but... <clears throat> yeah, Belarus is under attack. Seems to have attempted to take Poland out. With a little help from the Russians, but... Oh yeah, I forgot about Lithuania as well. Jeez. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. But you're gonna have to get er everything rebuilt. Let's play a little bit, and... Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. I did set the game time, game end time, to be around 12 months. So, by December, I think... I think... The whole game would just end. At least that's what I think it would happen, but... Yeah. 
I set it to 12 months, the same with South Korea. So there's a limit there, and let's see how many parts we can get by playing as either of these nations. Uh, at the moment, though, I'm going to try and reserve everything. Try and get the try and get the economy up, if that's even possible, because because demand is massive. Even with these military good facilities up and running, it's even at 100% capacity, it's not enough because of the demands massive. The same with industrial. So, comparison to North Korea's only mid facilities, it's not enough. And of course, there's the uh, problem of the military facility that's uh, gone. Gotta rebuild that, unfortunately. I don't know what to do if a town got completely destroyed, but that's also a slight problem. Domestic approval is on a negative trend, I'm not surprised. This small island is under our control, but I will be building a damn sea pier, a naval port, just to be safe. Uh, who wore... oh. Indonesia. Hmm. Interesting. Who else... is it possible to make any of no, not with Pakistan? Azerbaijan, Armenia, obviously not, so I'm not gonna bother. Saudi Arabia, Egypt... Huh. Israel is at war with... Syria. And... Saudi Arabia and Iran. Interesting. Uh, what's going on in North America? In the United States? Oh. They're at war with Mexico. And it seems like the Mexican army is actually holding the US forces off. At least temporarily. Okay. Strangely, there's nothing going on up here. The borders of California, Arizona, and Texas. Well, except Te well, Texas, obviously. You... So, wait. I know this is California. I know this part is Ariz Arizona? Uh, yes, I will be getting this message every time... Every time a nation falls, so... Might as well deal with it. In this case, the Georgia Republic is long gone. Let's take a look. Yep. It's long gone. But at this moment... Who knows? What to do? Japan or Taiwan? Oh yeah, Taiwan's at war with China. Chinese have taken up the oil derrick. That's right over here. But I'm not too sure of the AI and oh, the Phil Pete. Who's this? What? Okay, it looks like the Taiwanese had attempted to help, but they accidentally took this part ocean as theirs, it seems. Okay. Uh, elsewhere? China is also at war with... are they at war with... no, they're not at war with Mongolia. They are, however, at war with... India, who somehow managed to make a stretch counterattack and Nepal Nepal of all small nations yeesh well then who else are they at war with? East Timor, I don't see the point Papua New Guinea, Philippines, Russia yeah I nearly forgot about the war between China and Russia I don't know how this is gonna work between them. But yeah, that's about it. So, 
Yeah. Well, this is uh, somewhat of a one-shot, I suppose you could say, but if you want me to continue to play as North Korea of the uh, timeline, the time limit, I uh, already placed at around 12 months, and it's already one month already since the Second Korean War. Please let me know in the comments if you want me to continue this, including South Korea's campaign as well. Or Let's Play, I mean. So, see you then, and I promise I will be going back to my main other, my other Let's Play, Let's Play, Let's Plays of Supreme Ruler 2020. And if you have any suggestions of any other nations you want me to play as, let me know in the comments.